Welcome back to Six Flags Great America. We got the uh, front entrance construction over here. We can see the old flagpoles. And over here, you can see that there's a uh, lot more fencing going up. Looks like they have a main outer fence and then a lower inner fence. They also have the double fences going all the way up to this new concrete pad that has been poured. There's also some foundations right here. Yeah, definitely uh, some progress, but it is certainly not close to complete yet. Over here, we can also see that the double fence goes all the way down to the harbor entrance. And uh, yeah, is still under construction. Restrooms still under construction. At least we have good music over here instead of the blaring pop music. Doesn't really look like uh, much is happening over here. Well, it certainly is a Saturday in Great, at Great America. Nearly a full queue, queue full covered queue here at Joker. I find it hilarious that this shade structure still hasn't been installed. Over here at Winter Circle, we got X Flight. And holy crap, we got Sky Striker. That thing is absolutely massive on the skyline. My gosh. Oh my gosh, what an ugly sign. Looks like much of the park's midways have been uh, resealed for this uh, year. They do this every year, but uh, yeah, they basically retar the existing asphalt and make it look nice. This park really can be very pretty. Just absolutely wow. This thing is just freaking gigantic. Holy crap. Looks like this is what the supports were. Looks like they're putting up some shade structures over the path over here. Hopefully they'll put in a lot more benches and whatnot and make this a nice little sitting area. What a huge ride. Now Eagle is still inaccessible, but obviously Sky Striker has gone up. I still don't love that sign. I was hoping for the more geometric sign that they showed in the renders, but man, this thing is just massive. It's also Saturday, but there's uh, plenty of crews on site working on just the various different things. I bet the next thing that's gonna go in is uh, gonna be the ride vehicle. You can see, yeah, Sky High constructors over there. Sky High coasters over there. They're the ones who assembled Max Force, the ones who assembled Joker, and they're also, they also seem to be assembling this. What a huge ride. Looks like that's the uh, floor structure right over there, all that diamond sheet metal. Looks like this little kiosk is uh, being built quickly as well. Here's what the pirate ship area looks like. It's uh, just a big piece of concrete. X-Flight is back to two trains, but uh, with that line, I'm definitely not waiting. Here's a better look of what Demon looks like without the rocks. Honestly, it doesn't look half bad. I definitely miss the rocks, but the clear loops like this actually look pretty clean. Here we are over at the Windy City Sports Bar. Not a whole lot going on outside here. Definitely working on the outside bar. Shutters are closed and fences are out for the inside bar. So uh, I don't think there's going to be a lot going on there yet. Overall, the park is uh, much more alive this weekend than two weekends ago. Lobster is back assembled and running. So uh, overall, yeah, the park's looking pretty good, I guess, other than the front entrance. Here we are over at Bloodshed where uh, things are definitely being dismantled. Uh, this haunted house wasn't one of my favorites I think it was probably one of my least favorites at the park um, but you know definitely interesting to see it go after it's so new already 
That's a look at this line for freaking Demon. I mean, like, I love Demon more than basically anyone in this. That line goes all the way to the entrance. Like, holy crap. Wow. Nothing really seems to be going on at Buccaneer either. Wizards still closed. Doesn't look like anything's in the station either, so, uh, still a work in progress. Well, today's been pretty crazy here at Great America. Super long lines, lots of school groups, but uh, the park is looking a whole lot better in general, and uh, hopefully it'll continue to improve. Hopefully we'll see Sky Striker testing soon. First off, fully assembled, then testing, then opening soon. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.